In Matthew 19, 14, we find Jesus saying, Let the children come to me, and do not hinder them, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. As I go through this season with my two-year-old daughter, I kind of begin to understand why this is happening. You see, while all the world is scared and stressed and full of questions and conflict, Sophie and a lot of our... Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, is that, is that one yours? Do you want to come here and say hello? Do you want to say hello? Hello. So Sophie and a lot of other kids, that if you're lucky enough to have them at home, they're pretty oblivious to everything that's going on. And they seem to simply be able to enjoy the world and they still celebrate the lions on the front porch, hug the dog, be happy with mommy and daddy, and just be happy to be alive in general. Why? Ah! Oh yeah! Do you want to blow? Go blow. Good job. I think that... Daddy, Dad? Yeah. Oh. Ah! Oh, here, here, here. The kingdom of heaven is for such as these, because they're able to see the world not as what it is, but what it, as what it can be. Jesus did that with you and me. He was able to look at us not as we are, but as what we could be, or who we could be with Him. And He looks at the world not as it is, but as in what it can be. And notice that we're not saying what it could be, but what it can be, what it will be, if the world, if you and I, surrender our wills and trust Him. Trust that He can do for this world, that He can do for you and me, what little kids believe that their parents can do for them. Everything and only the best. So remember, as you go through stress, have the trust okay. that little kids have in their parents and our Heavenly Father. I hope that you guys have a very, very good evening. And we love you and we look forward to seeing you very soon. Sophie, can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Bye-bye.